Testimonials is what makes a business work. Is everybody, everybody knows that, right? Okay, so we need to have skincare testimonials and make it a big point in the meeting for a lot of reasons. A, to sell the products. B, the more people that we start getting in this business, we want to make them feel comfortable as being a skincare person as much as we have been, for most of us, weight loss and nutrition people. Okay, those people got to feel comfortable when they're in the room, okay? So in uh, Japan, we took a shot at it and we did a two testimonial countdown. Write that down. A two testimonial countdown. It worked unbelievable, okay, is what took place. So we said, okay, everybody that's uh, uh, lost weight and had some really excellent results on the nutritional products, stand up, okay? And we did our little countdown and uh, they came up and told about all their weight loss and what had happened on the nutrition and all that. But just uh, a little uh, a tip here, okay? Uh, especially for those of you who have more nutrition products, okay? Remember that the person that's sitting in the audience, they don't know anything except what they hear and what they see. So when we do these weight loss countdowns and they've seen a little bit of the weight loss product and you talk a little bit about nutrition and they just say, I lost weight, you, you got to remember the person sitting in the audience a lot of times thinks that a lot of those things have happened with just four or five products. When you're up there telling your testimonial, you say, listen, I got on a weight loss product and this, you got to tell the truth, okay? But whatever the truth is, remember, make sure that you tell the truth, okay? So that the person can not only hear what products you're using, but that more specifically that you sell the products that you're using. Write that down. Okay, and we got to teach our distributors how to tell those testimonials. Okay, so we got to teach the guy that's up in front of the room. They're they're ju they're just there for a little bit of time to tell them about the products to get the testimonials up. Uh, they're not they're not the important person in the room. The people that are important are the people in the room. They're the ones that set the attitude. They're the ones that set the momentum. They're the ones that are going to tell our testimonials. So we got to make sure our audiences are good. And that's going to have to happen in your training classes. So when you get back to your area, teach this, okay? You guys got to get it, but you got to teach it. And then write this down. Continue to teach it. People forget this stuff all the time. It's amazing to me how long you got a person in the, uh, in the business for 14 years and you still got to teach this stuff, okay? They just start forgetting about what makes everything work. Now, the next thing is, is we did uh, the skincare countdown. We made it specifically separate in the meeting, okay? So he said, now what we'd like to do is go to our skincare, and if you've got it, our cosmetics. And what was amazing, everybody felt different about the skincare business in a matter of 15 minutes, because we got the, the line of everybody, and then Billy and the group was over there uh, making certain that everybody pulled up their before and after pictures. And I'm telling you something, there wasn't anybody sitting in that room that didn't feel different about what we had just doing that. And it was an amazing transition that happened in the room. So um, you're going to need to do a couple of meetings, first of all, to make certain that your group brings the pictures, okay? The group brings the pictures. So when you go to this in your, in your, in your uh, HOMs, in your STSs, Specifically, you got a big group out there that's got some um, a crazy wild testimonials about our skincare and cosmetics. <laughs> so I like these two tiered countdowns because it puts the spotlight uh, on those particular products. It makes them, everybody realize, wow, that stuff must be really hot. Wow, this must uh, be a part of the business that's really making it happy. So by specifically making an issue of it in your business meeting, they're gonna think it's hot, it's out of control, this is something they gotta pay attention to, let's go, let's go. Okay, so I would put back in a two-tiered uh, situation in there in my, in my business meeting.